those like, West Virginia fans out there. Oh, that was great. I loved it. Our fans are the best in the nation, I think. And for them to come out there to fill those those stands up out there and overcrowd their crowd, and it was awesome. Did you all buy in to what the coaches told you about this environment? Yeah, we did. We knew it was going to come down. It was going to be hard to come out, come out of here with a win. And it showed out there, and we, we just executed at the end and, and pulled this one out. What's your feeling when you know you and the rest of the guys have to go at least five or six minutes without either Javon or Dax? Um, you just got to go out there and be poised and, and execute the plays and just stop some defense. It was, it was stretches, but we didn't, and it, it, we paid for it. And we knew stretches, what we did. We executed plays, and we, we got a couple shots in there for us. What about all the fouls? I mean, did it get you frustrated at all? Being no, out sir, there? The rest was awesome. Really? <laughs> Playing the 1-3-1, one, one, I know you've been there another couple games this year. This is the longest stretch. What do you feel like worked for you in this defense? Um, just getting out there, pressure, putting pressure on the ball on, on the corner of the ball gets there, and contesting their threes when they got there. And all the ones I contested, I, I think I did a pretty good job, and they missed on those other shots. What's the hardest thing for you about playing on the bottom of that? Uh, just rotating, rotating when the ball gets skipped. That's the hardest part. Just sprint out there and get to the next corner from one corner to another. What have you been?